we are here inside of After Effects. I'm going to go and grab the Star Tool, holding down the Shift key, or drag out a nice star like so. Now down here we have a new shape layer. Opening up the Transform options, let's have a bit of a play with the scale value. Okay, that's a bit weird. I'll undo that. What about rotation? Okay, this is even weirder again. Now clearly guys, the problem is this little thing just here. This is the origin about which our transformations are occurring. Now technically, this thing is called the anchor point. You may have also noticed there is an entry for the anchor point just down here. Now if you're tempted to try and adjust this thing, you'll find you're moving that, you'll then have to compensate by changing the position, you are going to drive yourself bananas very quickly. So let's not do that. Let me undo a few steps just here. Now I'd like to show you two different methods for moving the anchor point. The first one, let's come up here, the pan behind tool, keyboard shortcut is Y. So I'll select that just now. Now in this case, guys, I can still see the anchor point. Sometimes you may see that disappear. If so, just click on your shape layer to bring that back. And with this tool, guys, I can grab that anchor point and move it wherever I like. So if I move it to the center just here, come down to rotation, check it out. It's doing now what most of us would expect it to do by default. And the great thing is, guys, of course, you don't just have to drop it in the center, you can put it anywhere you like. So if I put it up here, play with our rotation again, very cool. Again, let me undo a few steps just here. So we're back where we started. And I'd like to now show you that second method for getting the anchor point into the center of your object. And this is using a menu option. So I've got my layer selected, layer, transform, center anchor point in layer content. Wait for it, and fantastic. Smack bang in the middle. Let's play with our rotation. There we go, very cool. So if I sound a little excited guys, it's because once you understand how you can move this anchor point, it really does open up a whole world of possibilities for you here inside of After Effects. So I hope that helps. Catch you later.